Hola, clase. I am the French artist Zara Z, and with you, I will be teaching you how to be a famous painter in France. Say, let's hop right into this. I'm not sure what that's French accent, but I don't care. Alright, so what you need is you need to get nice hat and looks like you are from France. Wear any short or anything, I don't care. And you're going to need a very, 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 very fine art easel and some markers to draw on the easel or paper or pencil, I don't care. Alright. So now that we have all of these standard colors, let's get ready to draw. What will we be drawing today? We will be drawing a very high detail picture portrait of this lovely woman. Very lovely, got the nice blue eyes and the pink lips and stuff. And I will be teaching you how to draw her in very great. That is the tutorial for today. Let's hop into the drawing portion of the tutorial. Alright, so for the painting, I will start off with the black marker to make this painting or portrait look very good. I will move this back because I am running out of the room. Like my GoPro is like right next to the easel. But we be, we do whatever we want. So there, I'm gonna fall over before I even get to the easel. Alright, so I like to picture my uh, image that I am drawing the portrait of this woman and we will start off with the head see that is a very good circle it's very good looking um very closely resembles the mark of the head all right so now we will go for the body shape this portrait of this person has two arms and two legs so we must draw those in the portrait, I will do that now. Drawing the two legs, give the little punt line, so we know that this person is going punt. And then we will give them the arms. These are very good quality arms right here, they're just one line, you don't need multiple lines to have all this high quality crap, you know. Alright, so now I want to draw the eyes. Um, you're going to need to draw in the pupils. But I will continue drawing out the... Um... I cannot sit on my knees like this for too long or I get the board. Um, but we will finish out drawing... The... Nose and the mouth for the portrait. So, alright, so we got a good nose right there. And we will draw the lips. Uh, we shall make the lips red. I cannot put the cap onto the mascara for some reason. Alright, so, we draw the little smiley face. That is the mouth right there. We will give her some rosy cheeks. Okay, so we will now color in the eyes. These markers are horrible. They, they, do, these, they get stuck on my sleeve. And it's on over my hand. But we don't care. Alright, so I give her a pupil. Alright. That looks fine. Um, she's got some hair. She's got a bonnet, but I can't really draw the bonnet on this sterling footage, so I'm going to just cut it out, because I don't want to. And she's got some reddish hair, so I'll give her the reddish hair. She's got like ponytails that come down, so we will draw in the hair now. I'm not drawing it with the bonnet, and then it like comes down into like a curl thing like that 
as you can see we will carry it down okay so this is looking pretty good um not even so if i'm speaking in the front the accent anyways but i don't care um that looks very good for the hair now i see that she has got a green shirt thingy on so we will draw that in now gonna draw the sleeves like so draw in these sleeves and then we need to color in completely as you can see she is looking mighty fine that she will pay good money for this portrait of herself so i see that she has pink shoes but we don't have the color pink because we are poor so we will use these for the shoes this looks more pink than actually red I don't know what kind of red this is. Um, now we are drawing in the shoes. And now we could make up a background. I would like to draw in some more features into the background, like the nature and the whatnot. So let's get very detailed here. Not sure where my red went. I need my black. I need my black. All right, so we will draw in the sun now. This is how you should draw in the sun. The sun is not circle, it is really a rectangle, so you just draw a rectangle and then you draw straight lines coming out of it. There you go, you have your sun, um, and then you will give a nice mountain side view thing in the background. That is the ground, the foreground of the portrait. And then we're gonna draw in some clouds. Very nice detailed clouds. Um, I'm not going to draw in all of the colors for this video because I simply do not have the time for that in this video. But maybe we will do that more in a different video. And I had a special request by her to draw in a cat by her feet. So that is what I'm going to do. I'm going to draw in the cat. So you know cats have a tail, four legs, and a face. So let's draw that in. So I'm going to start with the face. Alright, so you want to get the, the head correct. Alright, so now we have like the head shape. We got to give it the ears. Okay, that looks pretty good. Alright. Dawn in the it's a black cat by the way. And then we gotta give it the face. And give it some whiskers. Give it a little tongue. And there you go, there's, there's, there's the face of the cat. Alright, so then we're going to go back and come down. And then draw the paws. What do you get? Give it a nice little tail. And then you only have two here. So there's a little technique that you can do to draw in enough two extra legs and do that. And there you go. You have a cat with the portrait of the nice looking woman. And um yeah, so that's not really too much else we can draw because that's all I was asked to do. But maybe I will draw in a little house or a little soccer ball. We will draw in a soccer ball. Okay, no, we, no, 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 no. She's not a soccer player. Although her feet may look like she's got cleats, she's not a soccer player. Well, never mind. She plays. <laughs> Sorry, excuse me. Um, she does not play football. Um, I'm thinking of what to, to draw in it now. No, what should we draw? I don't care. I think this is a very good representation of the target. We have a nice looking sun, we have some clouds, we have her, and then we have her nice pet cat. 
which I didn't really have a good description of drawing with. I just knew it was a black cat, so I just do a stereotypical black cat. It's got a nice tail and a nice face completely. So now I want to give you a close-up shot of the whole portrait, and we will compare it to the regular person, and we will go on from there. So this is what we drew. I'm going to go back up. And we will compare it to the target, which was this. As you can see, I got the nice detail of the hair. As you already said, I'm not going to draw in the bowl or this, because I didn't want to. Screw you, I'm not doing that. Got the nice little ponytail thingy. Got the nice shirt, the nice green shirt. We didn't really draw in detail. This is a rose, maybe we could have done that. And we came down here, and we got the, the white pants were already white. So, this is, um, if I were a buyer, I would pay around $3,000 for this painting because it is very, 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 very highly made, very high quality by me. So, yeah, I think, I don't think Pablo Picasso could even paint a better drawing. I think this beats the Mona Lisa in uh, terms of detail and aspect and ratio and all this other art terms. But, um, yeah, so that is the tutorial for today on how to be good at art. Um, I hope you have enjoyed, and I will see you next time for more tutorials. Goodbye. All right, now with that, we're done with that amazing art tutorial. I ain't gonna bother doing an accent again. Screw that. That was stupid. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm gonna hand sandwich right now. It's pretty good. Um, but anyways, it's time to leave your comments. Then the last video. No, it's Sunday's day. Which I haven't done in a while. <laughs> like, I need an idea, and then I gotta, like, do the idea. So. Yeah, it was. Oh, I actually did it last week. Cool. 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 Oh, yeah, because it was Easter. All right, so. Let's see if there was any comments at all. Oh, there was two. Hey, we should play MC together one day, and could you check out my channel and see if you like it? Bradley Rival. I guess, I don't care. I don't really play on Mindflex too much. I play Cubecraft a lot. Because uh, 1.9 on that server, it's just... Oh, I love 1.9 PvP. It's so good. Um, Apex Order. Nice intro. Thank you. Um, I'm going to read a couple of his comments. Those are two. Carmageddon. If you haven't seen the GTA 4 Carmageddon highlights, I highly suggest that you do. Because I thought it was funny. I, I did try to add all the funny parts into it, and it's pretty great. I mean, the first scene is just a woman standing in the middle of the street and hit by a flying car. I mean, you know, that's totally normal. Um, that video actually has zero comments. Somebody told me it was a really nice video, and I should make more. But, uh, I guess not. Um, from the low life. Low life is the best life. Egg Wars, which I actually posted yesterday. Oh man, I love Egg Wars. Egg Wars is like my new Bridges. Except I don't play it like Bridges at all. Like, I get no gear, but I just go over and I just ninja eggs. Like, I don't even have a word for it. I don't even know what you would call that. Like, sneaking around and like destroying people eggs when they expect it. Is that like ninja ing it? Or is there a different word for it? Like, I don't know. Tell me what word you want for it, and then I'll use that word. But I just say I'm a ninja and just sneak around. And I do the low life, I do the high life. Probably be doing some Egg Wars compilation of that alone, like me sneaking around, like killing the egg and the, the reaction after that. But, uh, yeah. The Diamond Mew, lol, 27 seconds ago. I guess that's when I uploaded it, 27 seconds ago? I don't know. That Nerdy Gamer, second. 
I love those. Very pretty cool um, thing. Ooh, we should read stuff from my Happy Face book trailer. If you haven't seen the Happy Face book trailer, I highly suggest that you do. Because that was another video where I put a lot of time and effort into it. Well, I had live action as well. It has one comment. Nice already. XD, and that's it. Alright, well, that's pretty good. Um, I have 46 Bridges videos. Oh, Bridges and Survival Games. I have 46. Dang. I have a lot. I have a lot of, like, subjects. Like, I have, like, a crap ton of playlists. I have, like, a playlist for, like, everything. Final Flex Reviews, 25. Plot Me. I never really did that. I never really continued that. Somebody liked it. I never did it. I never really continued it. Um, it has the most. Liked videos has it the most, because, well, the. Um... Reviews has the most. Sundays is coming up close. But I don't really do my Netflix reviews anymore. And I did hear that uh, they updated clans. But I can't even get into clans because it's always full. So I just said, you know what? I'm not going to bother with clans. Clans was a bad idea. I felt like from the start. It was it sounded like a really cool idea. And then you got, I got in the alpha and I'm like, this thing this sucks. It's like, it's too complicated for such a simple concept of factions. Like, jeez, man. I would just have, like, a survival world, like a... Like a claim in your spot world. Like, I would just have that. Like, that's just me. Like, just... I just want to, like, chill. And, like, hang out with some of my friends on Mindplex. And just, like... Just build stuff in survival mode. And, like, have a big epic base or something. But at the same time, not have it be, like, destroyable. You Like, you think you would be able to, like, whenever you place a block, nobody else can destroy that block except the person that placed it down and the, per pe and the people that that person trusts in their building. You know, that would be a cool concept, but I guess it would be too much lag on the server because then, like, you got, like, 500 people placing a block at the same time and it'll, like, lag out the server. You just gotta compute all that but yeah um some count this week 782 i don't even know where 750 went but um thanks i'm really looking forward to that 1000 but we're not there yet we are three quarters of the way over three quarters of the way um i'm looking for 800 800 i don't know what i'm gonna do 800 is just cool um but once I hit like 900, I'm gonna be like, bruh. Let's do something cool. Uh, might do something cool for 800. I don't know. I can't really live stream because I got like limited. I don't have unlimited internet now. I got limited internet, and when you live stream, it takes up a lot of data from the data, data, da data or data. I don't know. I don't care. However you want to pronounce it. Um, takes it up from the monthly thing, and if we go over, you gotta pay extra. It's like. Pretty stupid. Um, anyways, please, please, please let me know what you, videos you want to see. Um, Bridges, you can still play that. I don't really care. That's still a fun game. Um, Egg Wars, I'm definitely going to be doing more Egg Wars. Going to be doing more edits for Egg Wars, not the whole long matches. Um, I'm doing some Mindplex social experiments. Like, how easy I can get banned. And, like, asking questions in the lobby and seeing how, what answers I get from people. And also, yeah, Bridges, um, GTA 4 and 5, the whole GTA series I might be doing more of. Sundays, obviously, some skits are going to be implemented in there somewhere. Because the skits are the best. Like, I love doing live action stuff. It's really fun. It's just like, I gotta get out there and do it with my GoPro. I need to get a better camera. If I didn't have a GoPro, it would, have been, it would be a lot better. I just need like a camera person just hold the camera. But nonetheless, uh, this is concluded as on this with Sartes. You are now an art artist. That's totally not. If you want to see more art tutorials, I will definitely be making more if you want to see any more. And I'm probably offended a lot of people that actually have this accent accent i tried to go for france like french probably didn't hit that on the nail at all 
probably sound really bad, but you know what? I don't care. <laughs> Anyways, hope you guys enjoy, and see you guys next time. Peace.